quite a few of the other content creators has lately been releasing videos about a possible Africa 2.0 map and what it could look like. And I think it's a pretty good opportunity to take it and uh, give my thoughts on what I would like to see in an Africa 2.0 map. And uh, if I even believe we're going to be getting any Africa map anytime soon. Since an old community created thing with a bush elephant resurfaced, it's actually something that's almost two years old, but was brought up by some of the other content creators lately. And it has really sparked the idea of an Africa 2.0 map. Obviously, I have been a big advocate for getting a new Africa map at some point soon. I would love to see it especially if they would actually go out of their way and bring in some of the bigger animals that they, they have kind of said that we probably won't see. But uh, watching an EW stream lately, the community manager were actually talking about that never say never, but currently it's not on the cards that we're probably looking to get any kind of elephants or anything like that. Elephants, rhinos and such. There is something with the ivory that I think EW think it's like putting your hand directly in a wasp nest. Is it a route they want to go down? Do you, would you like to see elephants and uh, rhinos, even though this is a, only a game would you not want to be able to hunt them because of how the entire world is together these days with them? Um, you know, there is just a lot of different things going on, right? Personally, I am 100% behind the idea of putting them in the game. I want to see elephants and rhinos. I want to see giraffes. I want to see hippos and all those big animals that really makes Africa what it is. I'd love to see some zebras as well. Um, personally, I think those might actually make it in. I don't know if they're really very hunted in uh, an Africa uh, in terms of a game species, but with the sheer amount of numbers of zebras we know that exist, I don't see why they wouldn't put them in. We also have awesome animals like Sable and Eland. Um, obviously, the Greater Kudu could be a very nice addition to any Africa map as well. I'm kind of happy we have the... Uh, Lesser kudu, but you know, I need, oh, I need the right gun for that. And um, I need a greater kudu. It's such a majestic looking animal. And I do, if they have the horns and such from the lesser kudu, I think it should be a pretty easy way to make the greater one as well. At least I, oh, that's actually aggressive. It's going to be eating us guys. <laughs> I almost wanted... Yeah, 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 we're gonna let it do it. We're gonna get uh, hit by bacon here. Uh, Oof! Uh, Is it gonna continue? Uh, I don't know. We're not gonna let it get down. But let me know what kind of animals and such you would like to see on an Africa Reserve. I do not think we're getting an Africa Reserve as the next one, though. I do believe that... Uh, I have a weird feeling that they're really going to be catering to us this year with first, I'd love to see it. I am very much for it. I'd love to see an Australia map come out here in the summer. I think they could make a very interesting Australia map. What would I like an Australian reserve to look like though? Having pick a bean bay meeting bush rangers run could definitely end up with a very interesting reserve. You have the rusa, you have the sandbar deer and such, um, with banting uh, from pick a bean bay. I would love to see kangaroos, but I've um, I see a lot of you guys are like, eh, I'm, I don't know if I want any of those jumpy boys around. Um, I definitely think we should have some kind of feral goats as well, maybe even some feral. Um, Dogs could be interesting as well. But now we're just getting sidetracked again. I don't know why that happens so much these days. I don't get to play a whole lot myself um, due to some of the bugs and such. Still putting me off a little. Uh, and I do see your guys' comments with a lot of you are struggling with uh, a lot of dumb stuff going on in the game. Hopefully it is going to be fixed whenever the new update comes out. And they're looking towards three or four weeks from now. Where there's also going to be a population reset of certain maps. Um, there was four maps mentioned. Mississippi. I think it was for Hong. Uh, Rancho and was it ever raw? I'm not sure but something like that so if you're currently doing a great one grind either speed it up or take a little break I don't know there is uh, new stuff coming up at least and then 
I don't know what it is. They've just confirmed it is not a map. Also, guys, if you're looking for um, the best place in the game to hunt Gimswag, this is a pretty good place. Uh, I don't know if you've ever checked it out. Full to late in the morning. The lake all the way down here to the south at the fever tree forest. There is a... I want to say a million, but obviously there is not. But there is a lot. And um, you even have some pretty big boys in between. That is a potential diamond over there. Let's just pick her out i'm actually interested to see if we can make that shot should be liver i think it is indeed but just in general with what i've shared so far what do you think ew's roadmap is going to be i personally have no idea what we're going to be looking at here in a few weeks of time when they're coming out with a new dlc or update i hope Maybe we could be looking towards getting some uh, loadouts, would be very nice, but they've been hyping it up like it's something big coming and it's it's really gonna make Call of the Wild, do good for Call of the Wild, right? So, would loadouts do that? I don't know. At least they're fixing the Send Eliminator, right? It's only been five years, but... I'm not sure what we're going to be looking at. I do hope it is going to be something that's going to lead into the uh, Waterfowl rework, which they have been promising as well here uh, sometime during the year. I think they were talking about the first part of the year. So if that is um, still on track, we're probably still looking at a few months until that happens. And let's just see if we did pick up a diamond with this girl. We did not. 327. Not big enough, unfortunately. Oh, we've actually got the long shot. Nice. I don't know what it is. Maybe you do or you have an idea. I'd love to hear it in the comments down below. And uh, yeah, I'm sorry for this video being a little bit all over the place. But I had a lot I wanted to talk about. And uh, I think we basically got around most of it. And I hope some of it made sense. And I hope you want to be uh, joining us in the... Di uh, um, don't, don't join me in the description. Do join me in the comments down below with your thoughts and ideas. I'd love to read them.